Hey everyone, Jay Kirschfield again from Unshuffled. In today's video, I am going to walk us through how to set up and play gut style games in the platform. Gut style games are not for the faint of heart, they're pot matching games. Uh, that means that players who who lose uh, end up having to match the pot, uh, so they can get out of hand pretty quickly. But they're a lot of fun, and they're a lot of fun to play with your friends. So um, we're going to go ahead and play two variations of gut style games. One where the player just has to beat the other players at the table, and then one where the last player standing has to also beat the deck. So uh, I'll show you exactly what that means once we get into it. So first, we're going to create a template. I'm going to start with a blank board, and this variation of guts is three card guts, so three card poker. So each player is going to get three cards. One, two, three. And then I'm also going to deal three cards in the center. Um, these will be cards that, if we want to play with a deck hand, um, that, they're, that that option is available. So uh, you'll see what I mean when we actually start playing, but I'm just going to put those there for now. Um, next, we'll go to the deal order. I am just going to deal the player hand cards first. I'm not going to deal this card, these cards because there's a chance we won't need them. And then I will go to Custom Settings, select Gut Style, and then name my template. I've already created this template, so I'm not going to go ahead and name it. Um, and that's it. Uh, I'm going to jump into a room and then show you exactly how it is played. Okay, so now we're in our room. I've got the video turned off for all these other players just because I don't want too much going on, but I could very easily turn it on because I'm playing with myself. Hello? Turn that off. And we're going to go ahead and play this gut style game. So first I'll go to start hand and I will select this three card guts beat the dealer. Um, one thing that's important to know is that you can't play gut style games uh, if blinds are turned on. So make sure that you have antis turned on. I did that when I was creating this video. It was annoying. I had to leave the room and restart it. So just remember, antis for gut style games. Load the game. And there we go. We've got our three cards dealt to every player. Uh, antis are posted automatically. And then typically playing a gut style game, each player would... Um, hold their cards in front of them, the dealer would count down from three, and then they'd either stay by holding onto their cards or drop by letting go. Players that drop are, have their cards folded and players that stay are eligible to either win the pot or potentially have to match the pot. We don't want to have to uh, rely on that dropping of cards because it's kind of hard to see cards in the little video screens that we have. So what we've done at Unshuffled is we've created this declarations feature. And as a dealer, I click Declarations, and then each player has the option to either stay or drop. So in, um, in three card poker, uh, the best hand is a straight flush, then three of a kind, then straight, because that's harder to actually make statistically, um, then flush, then a pair, and then a high card. So um, I am gonna go ahead and get a few players to go here, so. As players make their declarations, you will see the three dots turn into check marks. That just means that a player has made their declaration, but we're not revealing it until the rest of the players have also made their declarations. This is just so that we don't have any unfair advantages for players making decisions, knowing what other play people had to say, and it kind of recreates that dropping at the same time experience. So um, we'll go ahead, and once everyone has declared, you'll see... Okay, only two players stayed and two players dropped. The players that dropped will automatically be folded. We'll show our cards, and then uh, we'll select the winner. In this case, I will select myself as the winner, and hand, select winners, pick me, distribute pop. And you'll see, automatically, we're, we're saying that George W. has to match the pot. Um, if you were playing and you had a group that said, hey, the max loss is only 20 chips, so maybe four people lost, and we're only having people match up to 20. You could always change this to 20, but in this scenario, we're just going to leave it at 40. We'll confirm, and uh, the hand will restart because two players stayed. Now, the way the dealer button moves to the next player is uh, only one person stays. There's no mat pot match. The pot goes to zero. We're going to deal the cards again. And we'll see uh, what happens when um, everyone drops if we're playing a play the deal variation of, uh, of gut style poker. So uh, again, as a dealer, we'll take declarations. I have a flush, so I'm gonna stay. 
Typically, if you weren't playing in the play the dealer variation of this game, you would click end hand, select winners, select yourself as a winner, whoever the last remaining player is, distribute the pot. And then because there were no losers, the pot would go to zero, zero and then the dealer button would go to the next hand. That's not how we're playing this version though. We're gonna play a version where you have to actually beat the dealer. I like this version more. I think it's kind of fun. Um, so what happens is uh, the dealer then has to play three cards into the middle hand. And these would be considered the like the deck or the house. And the last player remaining has to have a better hand than the middle hand in order to uh, win the pot and move on. If they lose, they have to match the pot. In this scenario, uh, I will show my cards to just prove to you, the rest of the players that I have a flush that beats the dealer. I'll go end hand, select winners, pick myself, distribute the pot, and then confirm and end the hand. And that's how you play gut style games. There are a ton of variations of gut style games. And you can actually play any game that you want gut style. I mean, you can play Texas Hold'em, you can play Omaha. I've never seen it before, but hey, people have done crazier things with poker. Um, we have a really fun variation of gut style poker called Iron Cross, uh, which I have a video for. Um, you can check it out. Um, but if you have your own variation of gut style poker that you want us to make a video for, please you know, add a comment in the video or submit us a ticket on unshuffle.io and uh, we'll connect and we'll, we'll get it made. Um, if you have any other questions or comments or thoughts, please don't hesitate to reach out. And yeah, thanks for watching.